Bismillah, alhamdulillah, wa salatu wa salam ala rasulillah. Welcome to chapter 5.2 to 5.7 help notes for Nahmad and Haywood, a new Arabic grammar. In this chapter, we're going to, in this video, we're going to talk about the different types of plurals that are available in Arabic. I'd just like to start off with an example in English. If we have the word car, it becomes the word cars. All we did was add an S. If we had the word boy, we just add an S to make boys. These are regular plurals, but if we have the word child, we can't just add the letter S to make the plural. We actually have to add a whole new suffix, R-E-N, children. So sometimes we have uh, plurals that follow simple rules, and sometimes we have plurals that follow complex rules. Another example is foot becomes feet, or foot becomes feet. <coughs> So the point is that even in English we have regular plurals and we have irregular plurals. So given that background, let's look at the Arabic language. You have the word Muslim becomes Muslimuna. Khabaz becomes Khabazina. Sayyara, Sayyaratun. Al-Malika, Al-Malikatun. So these four examples, the top two have <coughs> roughly the same way of forming the plural, they add an ending at the end, which is either wa noon or ya noon, and the second, uh, the third and fourth examples just add an alif and ta, alif and ta. But what about this word here, masjid? It's not masjidun or is it masjidat? It is masajidu. We have a letter that's inserted into the original four letters of the word. So you have the meme, and there's the meme. There's the seen, there's the seen. But between the seen and the jim, now we have an alif and then the dal. <coughs> Likewise, bait does not become baytun or baytat, but buyut. Again, we have the original letters ba, ya, ba, ya. But now between the ya and the ta, we have a wow. These first two types are more regular. The, sorry, the first four types and the last two are irregular. Let's see what they're called in Arabic. So we have the words Muslimun, Khabazin, Sayyarat, Al Malikat, Masajid, Buyut. Muslims, uh, bakers, cars, queens, masjids, mosques, and houses. So the first two are known as Jam al Mudakkar as Salim. Jam means plural, Al Mudakkar means male. The <coughs> plural from male nouns. As-salim is sound. And in English this is translated as the sound masculine plural. The next two are known as Jam' al muannath as-salim. Jam' plural. al muannath female. As-salim, sound. The sound feminine plural. And the last two are examples of what are called Jam' al-taksir. Plural, broken literally broken plurals or what we would call in English irregular plurals <coughs> because the rule that is used to form them is not the most common rule um, and they do follow set patterns but for the moment consider them as irregular whereas these words follow a regular pattern and that brings us to the end of this video وآخر دعوانا أن الحمد لله رب العالمين